what my pant size uh, is, and it's... It's, don't tell me, don't tell me. I'm going to guess, you're not a 32, you're like a 28 waist. 28 waist. 28 waist. But I cannot find a 28 waist. I have to wear a 29 waist, 36 extra long. you got to go to the tall little boy store. Yeah, it's right? crazy. <laughs> it's really crazy. Really? So so where do you get the jeans at? I mean, what, what are those? Uh, Levi's? What do you got? What are you Diesel jeans. Who? And diesel. diesel. Oh, Diesel. And okay, so they're, they're the $300 only, jeans. Yeah, they're the only jean company that I can find that actually makes my size. Oh, because and they're... they're even, at the, even at that, I have to have them tailor fit. I mean, aren't those at. like a European cut, though, right? I mean... Yeah. Uh, but those, those are like... How much... How much you pay for those jeans? Uh, you know Literally. what? I don't even remember. Really? I don't, I don't think they're as much as you'd Over a hundred you know, bucks? Yeah, over a hundred Over a hundred bucks. bucks for Okay, but here's jeans, the thing. Right? And I, I recently introduced a friend of mine to this concept. If it's something that you wear all the time, you figure out cost per wear. Because I have no <laughs> qualms. That's how women justify no, but buying it's true. clothes. Thank you. Because I don't, I don't have any problem paying a hundred dollars for a pair of jeans because it's what I live in. So every day you put them on, you go, okay, that was oh, wow, only a dollar today. Yeah, Ugh. I mark it on my calendar. <laughs> no, but and it's we, true. And we're talking to Mo Pitney, country artist Mo Pitney. And I think we've actually talked about this before about the fact that I love your Dwight Yoakam vibe. Oh, really? <laughs> no, well, oh, wow. Well, that's been told to you before in the studio. Yeah, Somebody said, that, hey, yeah. wow, deja vu. You know, it's yeah. like here's who was that? That was a producer, I guess. Uh, right? It was Jim Ed Norman who actually is. Uh, runs a label right now right. Curb uh, the first meeting that I had with him he says man I, last time somebody stuck their ostrich skin boots on my coffee tables when Dwight Yoakam came in because you put them up and like wow deja vu I'm having deja yeah. vu right now yeah, yeah. which is pretty cool you do have a vibe because you're very traditional country I mean more traditional country than what's out there right now you know yeah, so there, well. there's you and on the other end of the spectrum there's Sam Hunt yeah, <laughs> and everything in between. And everything in between. That's why there's 50 flavors of ice cream, man. Well, that's oh, a good I point. love it. <laughs> oh, my God. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, anything? So uh, tell us real quick. Let's talk business. Uh, what do you got coming out here? Uh, we released my new single, Boy and a Girl thing, about a month and a half ago, yeah. probably. Um, we just got the music video done for it. I got the rough from it a couple nights ago, and I think I'm going to see the finished work of it today or tomorrow, right. actually. Hopefully in the next couple of weeks that'll be out, which is exciting. And uh, by the first of the year, hopefully we'll have the record out. The record's finished. We're just waiting on uh, how the single does to see when we're going to have a release date. And that All kind right, of thing, weighing so. it at 150 pounds at six foot four. <laughs> it's Mo Pitney. Thanks a lot, Mo. Thank you so much. Thanks for joining us. Awesome. All right.